And look who we have here in studio, Golden State Warriors rookies, Brandon Pajemski, Trace Jackson Davis. Thank you so much for stopping by NBA Today, gentlemen. Appreciate you having us. I am looking forward to our conversation. Trace, I want to start with you here. The Golden State Warriors, they, they've really turned a corner you guys have since inserting you into the starting lineup. You've gone 7-1 and one since March 27th. What's it like playing with the duo of, or trio rather, of Clay, <laughs> Draymond, Steph? Um, it's great. Um, I call them the three-headed goat. Um, the three-headed goat? Yeah, absolutely. They're just <laughs> monsters. Um, but at the same time, being able to play with them, the experience that they have, that they've given me, the confidence that Coach Kerr has given me. Also, throwing in CP in the equation, mm. um, it's been great. Three-headed goat. I don't know if there, there's a nickname that can top that. Nah. It's just three-headed goat, and we're going to leave it there. But, you, Brendan, what's it like, though, when you're coming into an organization that you know has won four championships over the last decade, that has these future Hall of Famers that are compiled on this team? What's it like being a rookie in that type of environment? Uh, I would say it's fun, but it's also a little bit daunting at first. Mm -hmm. um, you know, you see how much they've done, what they've won. Um, what they've done to get there to where they are now yeah. and then you add yourself and you know trace into the mix and you know you take a step back and you know what they bring but you also know what you bring mm. and for us it was finding that the happy medium of you know what they have but what else we bring um, Steve if we win this year you have his 10th ring to fill both hands getting CP his first one would would mean a lot to me and trace because CP has poured so much back into us yeah um, being a newcomer just like us and I think us as a whole, collectively, the Golden State Warriors, we have a bunch of young, but we have a lot of old, too. And so finding that mesh um, to be able to succeed, um, I think we've done a pretty good job. Do you call them old when you're, when you're oh, saying, yeah. oh, yeah, we're the young, yeah, yeah. you guys are the yeah, yeah. old? I'm sure they take that really, yeah, yeah. really well. <laughs> I'm sure that's something they take well. We only really have a couple of days left in the regular season. It's kind of wild that we're already marching towards the playoffs. With that being said, Trace, what's the locker room like? What are the conversations during this stretch as you guys are jockeying for seating and playoff positioning? Um, it's huge. Um, the locker room has always been good. It's been good this whole year. But um, as you get to the end of the, the road, um, we got three big ones. We take them one game at a time. So we got Portland coming up. Mm -hmm. And so that's going to be huge. And then after that, two home games. And we struggle a little bit at home. So um, trying to get that in check before the play-in starts. Does all rookie come across your mind? Yeah, uh, all the time. Every week I, I see the NBA.com's new rookie ladder. This morning I just saw it with Trace at number 10. So to see both of our names in the top 10 list um, was super fulfilling. But I think in a much broader perspective, if you could redraft, you wouldn't take me 19 and you wouldn't take him 57. So, um, you know, we've made our impact and put our print on the, the NBA so far. And I think we're the best rookie duo in the league. Best rookie duo in the league. You like that? I agree. Absolutely. I want to play a little game with you two before we, before we go. We're going to start with the Golden State Warriors. Who, who's the funniest teammate that y'all have? You can say yourselves. <laughs> Draymond. Draymond? <laughs> I'm going to say Lester. Okay. Pick one one of these two. One round of golf with Steph or a boat ride with Clay Thompson? I suck at golf, so I'm going to go boat. <laughs> okay. Go boat ride. I'm with you. I, I'm not a good golf player. Boat ride with All right. We're going both right. <laughs> All right. Uh, better teacher, Draymond or CP? Oh, CP. Whoa, that was fast. <laughs> you could talk for hours on end about everything, anything you want to know. Mm. Um, not even basketball, but just life skills. Right. CP's got you covered. I'm going to go Draymond. Okay. Just the way he's helped me defensively, how he's taught me about positioning and stuff like that. I'd go Dre. All right. Too short or E40? E40. E40. That's like Sophie's choice for me. I can't choose between those two. Be best trash talker between Draymond, CP, Draymond, and you. Not even close, Draymond. <laughs> okay, Draymond's Draymond. taking the cake. He <laughs> gave that to himself as yeah. well. Gentlemen, thank you so much. Good luck the rest of the season, and we appreciate you stopping thank by. You, thank you, thank you. <laughs>